Hi everyone, John Cottrell here of Embody Yoga. And if you're having the same kind of summer like I'm having, then you'll want to stay tuned. I currently live in Salt Lake City and right now we're in the heat of summer and I really do mean heat. We're in those upper 90s and those low 100 degree weather days and even into the evening where some of the coolest nights are only 80 degrees and so you're definitely going to need something to keep you cool. So sometimes a, a moving yoga practice may not feel all that great because it just heats you up. You really want something that's going to cool you down. So I'm going to show you a pranayama exercise. Pranayama is just a breathing technique that you can use in many different circumstances. In this case, we're going to do cooling breath, cooling breath, and it's called Shitali Pranayama. Shitali Pranayama, or cooling breath. This is a very simple and very meditative breathing exercise that you can do just to help cool yourself down when the temperature gets a little too hot. So Shitali Pranayama. So basically this is mouth breathing and you'll be using just the movement and, con uh, and some contortion of your mouth, so to speak, to help you breathe in this fashion. So what you'll do when you, when you breathe in, you'll be breathing in through your mouth. It'll feel like this cooling effect and it feels very nice and very soothing. And then you just breathe out slowly. So there's two ways I'm going to show you how to do this. And one way I think takes some genetics, meaning you have to be able to curl your tongue, making that U shape with your tongue like this. Now, not everyone knows how to do that. And, and then that's okay if you don't know how to do that, but that's just one technique that you can use for Shitali breathing. And, and one reason for doing that, one, it helps to bring in this cooling breath. Also, it also keeps your mind and focused on the breathing since you have to really pay attention to keeping your tongue in that shape. And that really just draws your focus, your mind, your attention to that moment. So it has a very calming effect too. So let me quickly demonstrate it and then we'll do it together. So I'm just going to close my eyes. And that's basically it. So you can see I had my mouth slightly opened, creating that slight U shape of my tongue. And I just breathe in, just pulling the air in through my mouth. And when I do that, I really do feel this coolness hit the back of my throat. It actually fills up my mouth. And then I breathe out with my mouth closed. And that way you just allow that cooling breath just to, one, just formulate in your mouth, but then to move throughout your entire body. So you can do this for several minutes until you feel like you've gotten that full cooling technique. Alrighty, so let's try that. If you're able, go ahead and curl your tongue with your tongue just slightly out the mouth and breathe in. Just pull in the breath and then close your mouth and let it release. One more time. Good. Now, if you weren't able to curl your tongue, here's another way, and I just call it the sipping method. All you have to do is imagine like you're sipping a, a, a drink, perhaps through a straw. Just purse your lips, keeping the mouth slightly open and just Suck in the breath, just sip in the breath. And it does the same effect. You'll feel that coolness hit the back of your throat, really just filling up your whole mouth. And then breathe out slowly with your mouth closed. Let's try that together. One more time. Now that was just three breaths, but I really felt that coolness start to move around my whole body. Now, another part of this is try to breathe as slowly as you can, taking that long sip of breath in and that slow breath out. And that's that calming effect you'll have too. Because sometimes when we get heated, we get heated. We get anxious, we get 
overwhelmed, anxious, the heart rate goes up. And so if we're able to take a little moment just to calm down and just use some nice breathing to help ease the mind and body, plus cool down yourself at the same time, then Shatali Pranayama is what you want to do. Let's do it one more time together. And that's it. So try that. Even set a timer. If you can do this for several minutes, maybe set a timer for maybe for three minutes, maybe five minutes if you can, and just sit in a nice calm seat on the floor, on a cushion, in a nice comfortable chair, and practice this breathing. And feel yourself cool down in this hot summer heat.